Physics really carries on with some of the ideas that students will be familiar with from GCSE. It's all about how the world works and why do things behave as they do. Uh, so we're looking at forces and how they interact with objects, um, electric and magnetic fields and the effect that they have, gravity, what, what that's all about, what's going on there. Um, we carry on the ideas of energy and, and how energy behaves and how we transfer energy. But we also pull in at A-level some other ideas that students won't be familiar with, uh, such as particle physics. You know, we've got the idea of atoms, but we take it down even further than that. What's an atom made of? What's the, a proton made of? Uh, so we, we really look at the very, very small, and we also look at the very, very big planets and, and why do they behave as they, they do and why do planets orbit and, and what are the forces making it all work. How do stars work? What's a black hole? What's that all about? Um, so there's lots of stuff that you will be sort of familiar with and then some ideas that are completely fresh. There are three exams that all happen right at the end of the course now. Uh, the first one will be mainly stuff that you do during year one with a little bit of the year two work tacked on. The second exam is the rest of the year two work. And then the third exam um, contains, there's, there is an optional topic um, which we talk about and you get to vote on which topic you want to do. Uh, and also a lot of stuff about practical skills. So there's no coursework, but there are some practicals that we have to do during the course. And, and that last exam will be asking you about those exam, about those practicals and analysing data and that kind of thing. So a lot of our pe students go on to study um, physics, but any form of engineering physics will get you into that as well. So that's about how things work, um, again, taking that further. Um, but that's not the only field. We've got, um, it's very well regarded in the city, for example. A lot of physicists go on into finance and banking and the stock exchange, that sort of thing. Uh, law, um, legal circles, again, like physics um, because of the problem-solving aspects of it. Uh, so science, engineering, but that's not all. There are a very wide range of possibilities.